Hi everyone, Sully here from Black Ops Toys, coming at you today with a DJ Custom Forest Gump. Really cool box. If you know what this figure is based off of, please leave that in the comments below. Let's go ahead and take a look. Now, DJ's Customs has made a couple different figures. They've done a Joker. They've done a Terminator. Um, quality is, is pretty good on some of this stuff and not so good on the other stuff. What's in here, I've already taken apart a couple of these. These are, it's very good quality. I'll show you what I mean in just a second. So this does have two trays. Let's go over the figure. They did a great job on the head sculpt, in my opinion. It's a younger, if you know who this is based on, please leave that in the comments below. Anything Vietnam is hot, so especially Vietnam gear. So you have a H harness, metal rivets, metal hardware, metal buckle, and then the uniform, it's a good looking cut. Boots, great looking boots as long as you're not looking at the soles. Soles look really good, but are these proper for Vietnam? That's the question. Really nice button detail work. And then you can see that flower right there. So what's here? Great base, really good base. Really nice pack. Again, we've seen these from Hot Toys, from Toy Soldier, Hot um, Ace, but good looking pack. Really good stitching, good detail work. We have some pouches. These are ammo pouches. You have to unhook these, but stamped with US, this is all metal hardware right here. And you can see these Alice clips on the back. They're not complete Alice clips, so you should notate that. They will slip onto a belt, but you'll probably need to use a glue dot to fasten them. They do not come with a second piece. So from like Ace and Toy Soldier and a lot of the main brands that do Vietnam stuff, they would come with a complete Alice clip with a little metal clip that would slide in there to attach it to the belt. These do not, but these will go on the belt. Canteen pouches, same deal. Really good knife. It's all taped up down here. This is metal. So that's a metal boot knife. That's a nice, nice piece. I love the helmet. Love it. I love the toothbrush. I love the bug repellent. It's got words written on it. 147 written there. Good camouflage. If you know what that's supposed to be, leave that in the comments below. The one thing that it's missing, and the helmet is metal, so this is all metal, but it is missing any type of straps. So you could easily add some straps, um, but that's the one thing I wish they would have put some straps on this. So they've got some good stuff here, like some really good stuff, especially for picking up loose buys, especially Vietnam stuff. But some of the finer details have been missed. Compass pouch, stamped with the US, very nice. Angled flashlight. Metal clip right there. Some grenades. Some extra hands, and that about does it for this, this side. Let's go over here. M16, standard fare. Looks like the magazine does come out. Mm -hmm. 
looks like a single a single mold except for the magazine. So not the best detailed weapon, but you could weather that up and it would look cool. It does have a three prong barrel as well. So stand. If you know who that's based on, leave that in the comments below. But good representation of who the figure is. Saddle style. We get one of these backpack frames, and this is metal. Super, super nice. Good webbing, some metal detail there. That would go on there like that. Nice shovel. Does have a little snap down here, so you can pop that open. There you go, that's nice. Belt attachment. And then last but not least, we have a LAW rocket launcher. So one of the first things you notice is it's heavy. So this is all metal. This is just a cast piece of metal. Um, this right here, you can see those two prongs will go in those holes right there. This is all one piece. And once you do put it like that, you can strap it onto a back or to the backpack. But Heavy piece, no moving parts, and it does not open. We have had these in the past where they do open, made from damn toys or hot toys. But good piece of kit, especially because you would probably just be throwing it onto the backpack, so it's a static item. It does have some heft to it. So all in all, Vietnam stuff, good stuff. Good stuff all around. A couple of things that they missed, but all in all, a good copy of a picture of a guy in a movie. So if you like this video and you want to see more of them, make sure that you follow, like, subscribe, and share for more exclusive and cool Vietnam content like Mr. Gump.